feels like a real crisis of leadership, uh, both on the public health side and on the university administration side. A UBC professor is slamming the university for failing to verify student vaccinations, provide on-campus immunization, and more accessible COVID testing. He says the institution promised these would be in place by the fall semester. On August 13th, UBC President Santa Ono said there would be rapid COVID testing on campus. He said there would be vaccination clinics on campus. He even supported vaccine mandates on campus. But those promises have yet to be seen. There's no way for a student that is unvaccinated to get vaccinated on campus and there is no testing going on. So if a student is symptomatic, there's no way for them to get tested uh, on campus. They have to go to one of Vancouver Coastal Health test sites. So basically they have to get on a bus while symptomatic and find a place to get tested. Throughout the summer, Mauricio Drelichman was part of the higher level discussions at UBC to ensure a safe return to campus. Part of their plan includes an online mandatory vaccine declaration. So two weeks into the term, um, about one third of campus has not completed the uh, mandatory vaccine declaration. And uh, there is no rapid testing in place. And there has been no verification of vaccination status. University spokesperson Matthew Ramsey wouldn't directly say what the consequences are for those who fail to declare their vaccination status. I don't have all those details and I'm not going to speculate on it. Like I said, it would be done on a case by case basis. As for why there are no vaccine clinics on campus. Well, yeah, vaccine delivery is is not the role the university plays. Uh, we have been hosting uh, multiple clinics uh, through Vancouver Coastal Health. Um, they are the ones who decide where to locate those clinics. Uh, also, we're not in a position to mandate vaccines. That's been very clearly articulated by the provincial health officer. Meanwhile, one student who wished to stay anonymous to avoid repercussion from the university has started tracking COVID exposures in class because she feels Vancouver Coastal Health was failing to provide timely exposure notices. I only post the things that get sent to me and that I can verify. But UBC and even VCH, um, they have far more qualified experts and scientists who would do a far better job at this than I can. Vancouver Coastal Health was unable to provide a comment before broadcast. In Vancouver, Kier Junos, City News.